to y'all. Welcome back to Rats Nest Hot Rods. Uh, this is a 1966 AMC Rambler. Uh, it is my friend, as you can see here, Ray's AMC Rambler. And it's got uh, some badly rotted uh, floor pans and also needs a new wiring harness. So that's what we're going to be doing over the next uh, few videos here, over the next few weeks. Um, so sit back. Sorry I, I don't sound so great. I've got a bit of a head cold, uh, but we're going to play more music and uh, that way you don't have to listen to me. So I'll cut in if there's something uh, of interest once Buckus leaves the frame here. A good work dog is always good to have and then uh, we'll listen to some music in the meantime. Here's a look at the quick wire harness. Well, actually just the box that's got the harness in it. That's the company quick wire. They make really good harnesses. Uh, I've installed a few of them and uh, they're pretty easy to uh, install and wire up as long as you got some basic knowledge of electrical work. And I uh, always recommend you get the actual service manual for your old car because it will help you a lot. Back to the music. Send a soul to the bathroom, he'll be as dirty as before. Now get down. song that makes my ears bleed I heard it on the radio at the dentist and it really got through to me I searched every station even left my house to go to the store that song was never something that came in pretty handy for us. Um, I have Ray down below um, and he's drilling up wherever on the either side of the unibody frame so that we don't cut into it. I thought it helped us out a lot. Drill the holes, mark it out with a paint marker and then get in there with the uh, angle grinder and cut off wheel and get to work.
this thing on the floor and get uh, Ray in there with the grinder. He's going to clean back about an inch and a half around every opening in there so that we can weld them shut. At the city gates, we got pressures of our own. This metropolis was my fate.
see we've laid down the uh, weld through primer. We're going to let this thing sit overnight and uh, start cutting and fitting in the pans in the, uh, the following day in real time. But uh, you'll see it next Friday. We'll start getting the pans cut um, and welded into place. Uh, I do want to say uh, thanks for subscribing and liking. We're almost up to 100 subscribers, which is really awesome. Um, thanks for the likes and the comments and all the support, guys. Peace and grease, sucker.